See that sign? Parking allowed. That is not something you see every day. <laughs> That is the face of a millionaire, ladies and gentlemen. That's what a millionaire looks like one day. Nope. <laughs> I can't even spell entrepreneur. That's why I don't associate as one. <laughs> but this guy over here. All right, what do you, so what do you do when it's like, how do you know when it's okay not to work? To be honest, I don't have an answer. Dang I'm, I'm still trying to figure it out myself. Um, I don't know, a lot of my friends and family, they, they always tell me, you gotta relax at some point. <laughs> There's deadlines. And, you know, I don't, so exactly. When you have an opportunity to like go somewhere, if you don't do it, in the back of my head, I was like, man, if I don't go on a show, like if I don't perform at this venue, I know that someone else will. And I was like, man, someone else is taking an opportunity that I know I could have. And I was like, how do I just give that up for having fun? I don't know yet. Like, you, 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 have, you have like no answers, nothing? Like, I don't know. If you have suggestions, drop it in the comments below. Please. <laughs> there's no rule that's like, oh, you work these many hours a day, then you rest for these many hours. Like, like, like I said, depending on the day, you either stay awake all night or you just like have a good night's sleep. You just don't know. Depends. I have been trying to, you know, when I go to the gym, I'll leave my phone back. Uh, oh, yeah. Or when I am hanging out with my girlfriend or my friends, you know, we'll make sure that we promise each other no phones for at least an hour or two. Don't let anyone tell you that they have, like, life figured out. Because when you get to, like, your full-time job, you'll realize that no one knows anything. I was like, bro, how do I send this email? How do I fill out this form? They're like, I don't know. It's a new, it's new to us too. Like, that's what I picked up on very fast. It's like, don't let anyone tell you they have it all figured out. No one has it all figured out. I mean, he might. No one has it all figured out. My bank. I haven't got my free hoodie yet, but I would recommend it. Okay, my favorite hoodie that you've made is yeah. like a, it's it's brown and it's like gold letters. Okay, we actually sold out on that. So. I'll get you another one. <laughs> See, like that, that's what I'm saying. Like they still, it's such a nice. Uh, I'm gonna pull it up really quick for them. That right there, and it wasn't just for the girl. The hoodie itself is actually really cool as well. Question. So put in the comments if you guys care about it. How would you feel if your partner, like husband, wife, like if you were a husband and your your wife made more money than you, how would you feel about that? And boom. So. What, what if your wife, wife made make more money than you? I don't know. I'll be a trophy husband. Dude. <laughs> Nothing better than that. I was I say the same thing. I was like, look, I know I'm gonna make a lot of money. So she makes more than I do. We're gonna have a very comfortable, lavish lifestyle. I was like, more power to you, girl, do it. <laughs> You don't like take a picture of it and put it on Instagram. Did you really eat it? Sweet potato French toast. Try it. Such a fancy meal. Like I'm so happy I got this. Yeah. <laughs> like when food makes you happy inside, that's a good sign. One of the most important lessons I learned is to not compare yourself to other people. They're on a whole different path than you. Lived a whole different life than you. Compete with yourself. Be better than you were yesterday. And in 365 days, you will be extraordinary. I don't think it's the best idea to like just drop the world and start focusing on your goals and stuff. Because there's no, like, why can't you start now? It's like, if you think that it's going to be easier, I think it's a complete misconception. Like, it gets harder. Yeah. But harder in a good like it gets harder, but it's like more fulfilling. When did you decide like okay, it's time to like let go of like being a full time employee mm -hmm. and being a full time like work for myself? Right. So I, because I, I mean everyone needs to eat and pay rent. And, Absolutely, and you gotta so eat. I held my full time job, uh, did everything on the side, nights and weekends. Did that for you know over two years, I think. And then finally got to the point where I was like, alright, this is becoming way too overwhelming. I have a few clients locked in, uh, things are picking up, and then I made the transition. I still don't know if, I mean, if it was the right time, but I mean, I felt ready to do so. All time. Look at him. Oh, look at that. 
Look at how cute he is. The older you get, the more you'll realize that nobody really knows where they're gonna end up in the future. I mean, your coworkers, your boss, your friends, none of them. We're all just winging it and moving forward. I have no idea if this YouTube or comedy thing is gonna work out for me, but I guarantee it won't work if I don't try. So until next time, you guys, stay fresh and stay cool.